light. Today I'm gonna be recreating probably the most viral makeup look on TikTok right now. It's the makeup look from this video from Leah Helton. I'm gonna be using a YouTube video as a reference. I don't have all the products, but I'll try to make it as close as possible. Alright, so first step is priming. Okay, so first off she uses a primer, a hydrating primer. Um, I don't have any primers anymore, I don't really think they work. I think good skincare is probably better, so I already did my skin prep. I used a hyaluronic acid moisturizer and now I'm also gonna apply some SPF. Eyebrows. I used this Love Up Brow Wax. Okay, so she uses one brow product only, which is like a gel. I don't have this specific one, but I have one I love more. It's this one, and I'm almost fully out, but I'm always like in denial when products run out. I'm just gaslighting myself, there's still product in it. So she like does that and then comes to side. My next step is this Hollywood Lola Silk Top. Okay, she uses a uh, foundation. I don't use foundation. I think concealers are a bit better. So I just kind of apply my concealer like it's a foundation. So today I have this concealer. It like puts it on like everywhere and then blends it out with a brush, which is something I don't usually do either. I usually use my fingers. Concealer. I clearly love this concealer. Okay, then she applies concealer to all the high points and on the eyes. I'm not a fan of the brush. I'm probably using the wrong one because she looks like she's using a very dense brush, which I don't have. So I'm just gonna continue with my fingers. Okay, so next up she uses a cream bronzer, but I don't have any cream bronzer. I have this Ellie Girl concealer, which is a darker contour shade. I've never used the powder blush, but I love the cream. Okay, now she's using a cream blush, which is, I only have liquid everything i don't have any cream products just liquid and powders so this is gonna have to do puts it like kind of low on the cheeks more on the side of the face puts it on her nose oh, i'm gonna try it i hope it won't look crazy mm, i kind of look sick <laughs> it's probably because i'm so pale she's gonna blend out everything like again without new product but like my brushes are pretty shit, so I'm just gonna try to use my fingers for that. Okay, so she starts using powders. I never set my makeup because I've got really, really dry skin, but I'm gonna try. She's using clear powder and a powder puff. I don't have a powder puff. I have some like SFX, like makeup sponges, maybe that will work. Okay, and then she puts a little bit of powder on a brush over the rest of her face. Like looking in the mirror, it kind of looks, it looks fine right now. But I know throughout the day, it's gonna look horrible on me. Um, and I still have to go to school after this, so. <laughs> okay, 10 year old, it's got bronze, contour palette. She goes over it with some powder contour. I don't really use powders, like I said, but for contour, I'm kind of like, it's on the least dry places on my face so I can I can tolerate it. It's, I always go in with this one, like a coral. She also puts on some more powder blush. She also again puts it on her nose. Not really for me, it makes me look sick. It makes me look like an ill Victorian child. Because I am contouring the nasal cavity with fake freckles. Okay, so then she puts on fake freckles, which I've never really done. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna use like a natural brown. Natural brown? And this brush. It's a bit dark. <laughs> mm. Maybe if I use the back of the brush like as a stamp. Oh, I'm horrible at this. Oh. Uh, uh. That goes my recording device. It's okay, it's okay. I just kind of feel, I feel like 
I'm cosplaying BB Longstock suit. <laughs> and then she goes back with the powder puff and kind of goes over it, blend it. So I'm hoping <laughs> this will make it less crazy. I think it's. It could be real. Could be. It was real to me! Favorite setting spray as you all. Okay, she uses a setting spray, which I also don't use. <laughs> I have a vitamin C like skincare spray, which I'll, I'll use as a substitute. That was not a gentle spray. Step of the face makeup, do this highlighter. Okay, then she uses a powder highlighter, and I think this shade kind of matches what she's using. She just puts it on her cheeks, on the high points. It's cute. Very cute. This is a separate brighter highlight for inner corners and nose, but instead I'm just gonna take a dense brush and make it wet and use the same one, so it makes it brighter. So far it's looking kind of cute. Not looking too dry, it's looking rather glowy even. I love a brown eyeliner. I love a eye br oh. I love a brown eyeliner too. I can't find it. I think it's in my school bag. Yeah. Got it. Okay. People are drilling outside. I don't know if you can hear that. I'm very sorry. She makes a like a willy thing. A willy thing. She makes like a really thin wing on only like the outer part of her eye. I can't do online or on video. I always <laughs> I always get nervous. Boyfriend, I'm nervous. Oh no. No. No, no, that's even, <laughs> it's even worse. Here is probably the most requested part of the whole routine, which is lashes. Okay, here's the thing, her lashes are incredible. She's only using mascara, but they're so long. Mine are not like that, they're not short, but they don't want to stay up. They just point straight down. So this part, I'm not going to be able to recreate. I'll try though. Okay, so one tip I do have is heating up. Heating up your eyelash curler, uh, not too hot. Check it in the palm of your hand. If it's too hot, don't put it near your eye, please. Look, I think they kind of stay up, but then I put mascara on and then they fall down. I'm gonna use some waterproof mascara today, which I usually don't because it's really hard to get off and I have very sensitive to eyes. I have very sensitive eyes. Like, luckily, luckily I, I have, have purse. purse. But today I'm gonna try it because then they probably will stay up better. I always get it on my on my lid. She says she uses her mascara like in an outwards motion because then they look more catty. But if I do that, my lashes just disappear because I don't have as much to work with. So I'll try. Still not long enough. She also doesn't apply a mascara on her bottom lashes, I think, which is very real of her. I support that. I love like only like makeup on the top of your eyelids that makes it look really cute. Which is lips, which again, it's one of the things that really ties the look. Okay, so she uses two lip liners. I only have one. I think it's really close to the color she's using. It's like a mauve pink. So I'm gonna try that. I think it looks kind of cute. My lips are really chapped up, but I can't put on anything moisturizing because her lips are matte. And if I put on the gloss, then it won't be matte anymore. But to be honest, my lips are always chapped. Like it's, <laughs> I try to avoid it. I try to moisturize, ex exfoliate. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. <laughs> Nobody wants to work anymore. Get your fucking ass up and work. That's a. Uh, that's the final look. I'm gonna do my hair and get changed and come back to you. So I'm back. I did my hair, put on a shirt. I don't know if I'm gonna stay with this shirt, but anyways, I did my cute little hair. I have a tutorial on that soon. Actually, I think I probably upload this video after the hair tutorial, but anyways. Review. I'm gonna take a close up. I actually think it's cute. <laughs> like the powder didn't make me look that dry. That's a plus. I can't really see my forehead because I've got bangs anyway, so I don't really 
care. I think it's cute. My lips are a bit chapped, but that is a me problem. Definitely don't look as good as Leah. I love, love her. <laughs> I think she's beautiful, but I do think I look good today. So thank you, Leah, for your makeup, for your viral video, for your tutorial, for your existence. Uh, yeah, I look, I look cute. Final review. Don't know if then cute.